April again, obviously. It is Tuesday the 15th of November, I think, and today marks the, f the date of my first diet vlog. So basically, I am sick of being the way I am. I feel like I am obese, like, um, many people have called me obese recently. My doctor has and things like that. Um, you know, people who I should trust. When I was, when I was 15, I weighed about eight stone and I was classed as a good weight, okay? My friend of the other person said that I should lose a tiny bit more weight. I still had my chubby cheeks and things like that and I ate a lot of cake, but I did an average amount of exercise and things like that. I weighed eight, so eight stone and I was about the same height as I am now. I haven't grown at all since then. I am now 18 years old. I, I don't exercise anywhere near as much as I did. I don't eat anywhere as healthy as what I did either. And I now am 10 stone, 11. Some weeks I'm 11 stone. So I felt like it, I should be eight stone again. So my goal is at least eight and a half stone, okay? Um, so I thought I'd best do a diet vlog. The reason for this is because I, whenever I'm on a diet, I don't stick to it like at all. And I try to, but I just don't. I just, food's just too attractive to me. And so is alcohol. So my thoughts are, YouTube means the world to me and I'm always trying to think of good ideas for it. If I do a diet vlog every so often, if I'm not going to lose weight for myself, can I at least lose weight for the for the sake of the vlog? I have made a list of dates and what weight I want to be by then. Um, basically, by the 3rd of April, I want to be eight and a half stone. There's still room on the piece of paper to add dates to it, though. There's a section saying the date, the second section saying my goal, and all that's filled in. And then next up there's a section for the actual weight that week. So I can keep track of whether I'm keeping up to date with it or not. And then the end one is, did I achieve my goal? And I just fill in that bit every single week, okay? The dates are, the um, is every Monday of each month, if that makes sense. So the first date is the 21st of November, second one's 28th of November. One after that's 5th of December, etc. Okay. Um, so, by 3rd of April, I want to be 8.5 stone, 8, eight, eight stone and 5 pounds. I really hope I can get to that weight. If I can't, then I oh will. At least I tried. As long as I don't gain weight. I thought I could do these vlogs every fortnight, so that's every two weeks. And I will talk about if I achieve my my goal and how I did it that week etc and this will all act as a diary for me so I can look back and track my progress without having you know more than just looking at a piece of paper it might come in more handy and useful because you know anything that I can do to help the better so I'm mainly going to try and lose weight by yeah making my portion smaller, you know, food portion smaller and a bit healthier. I'm going to cut down on cake and chocolate and alcohol and things like that. And I'm also going to do a lot more exercise. Of course, I can't cut down on alcohol completely. I still need to go out for a few drinks and things because it's a social thing. And, you know, I don't really want to miss out on the social aspect, uh, uh, the social aspect of it. So, I can still cook out out cut out cakes and chocolates and things like that if i want a cake or i want a chocolate perhaps i should make it myself so i know it's made from like semi skimmed milk and or skimmed milk and things like that you know what i mean and, I'm all, and i've also joined the gym a while back so you might have seen that through my daily vlogs so i'm going to start doing that every day as well apart from maybe the weekend when i'll have two days off since I'm doing it every fortnight, if I finish doing the vlogs on the date that hopefully I'll succeed, there should be about a 10 or 11 um, 
diet vlogs. So that'll be good. But of course, if I don't reach that and I still want to keep dieting, then I and I'll keep losing weight. Then I will continue the vlogs, and it also depends on how popular the videos are. If it gets like one view each, each you know, if each vlog gets like one view, it's a bit pointless. You get what I mean? But if they're getting like fifty, then I'll probably continue them until I want to stop losing weight entirely, or I just don't want to do the vlogs anymore. You might be able to tell I'm not like very skinny. I'm not a healthy weight. I look pregnant. Also, I thought if you guys are trying to lose a bit of weight, this might come in handy for you guys to watch. You know, you can diet with me if you want, you can do the thing with me. Now then, let me explain this. I'm hoping to lose about £2 for the £2 a week for the first part of my diet because I want to just cut out entirely everything bad for a bit, okay? Although on the weekend I might be a bit unhealthy, but still. Okay? But on the 19th of December and the 26th of December it stays the same way. That's because that's around Christmas time when we'll be eating sweets and chocolate and drinking alcohol and things like that. So I'm keeping that the same way because I'm not I'm not saying, oh, I'm having a sandwich instead of Christmas dinner because of my weight no I'm I'm still trying to keep things like that okay around the first week of February also um 6th of February and 13th of February that's around my birthday so of course I'll be doing all that then so I'm keeping that the same weight you know I want to be the same weight both them two days I don't want to lose weight um, I mean, I don't want to gain weight. Of course, I won't lose it because I don't really want to be doing any extra exercise trying to burn off an entire birthday cake. But at the same time, I um, don't want to be gaining weight. I want to try and keep that weight. But at the same time, enjoy my birthday. Then um, when it gets to when when it gets lower than nine stone, I'm only losing weight. Um, like I'm only losing three pound. I only want to lose about three pound a fortnight because I think it'll be a lot harder to lose weight once I've gone past nine nine um, nine stone because I'll be like because I've lost almost two stone basically. So I think it'll get a bit harder, and I don't want to be too hard on myself. You know, like I don't want to be starving myself to lose the weight. So I've kind of. Eased up, eased a bit there. I might also won't keep the vlogs a few weeks after the um, few weeks after the third of April, just to see if I can maintain that weight. Okay, below night, which is going to be like eight, eight stone five and below. Okay, this is also going to be like a safety mechanism. So like if I get anorexic or if I'm mistreating myself in some way like starving myself or developing any mental health illnesses due to it because you know you can get things like bulimia and things like that can't you then hopefully with the vlog friends who watch it family the odd bit of my family watch it and also you guys if you don't know me hopefully might spot it because normally you don't some things you don't quite spot yourself and then I can think you know, I can take a step back a bit then. I doubt anything will happen, but there's also that instance. So if it's on the, the internet, people can tell me, April, you need to chill out. Yeah. Maybe get a counsel. So that's what this entire vlog's gonna be about. I will next upload the um, vlog when? I might upload one next week, next Monday. If not, then I will upload it the weekend, the week after that. I can't quite decide when to start this fortnight process. Um, a fortnight is two weeks, by the way. And I'm hoping that the vlogs will be be yeah, filmed every Monday and either uploaded every Monday or Tuesday, depending on what I'm doing that day. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Comment below to let me know what you think of the idea. Like the video.
this this can be a little there. Uh, 